hey guys welcome back to my channel uh, we're having a lot of rain in Florida today but anyway I'm here chilling thinking what else can I do to my house <laughs> I'm so bad anyway but what I did to my house was I revamped the guest room I in my room I have white linen white everything I love it I love the fresh look crispy of white sheets and comforters and blanket I love all that everything is texturized so it's not like you know just plain white but anyway I did the same thing to my guest room but I don't think that was a good idea because I am extremely careful with my whites comforter and sheets and blanket but my guests aka my children are not so careful so I decided to change it and so I change it up a little bit um and I'll show you but before I show you let me tell you what happened to me Saturday now I will say I'm a manner mild manner person so for someone to get me upset to that extent anyway so I went retail therapy on Saturday feeling good Stop and had lunch and everything and I was coming back. It was around uh, Maybe six, but it was already dark. I hate when it gets dark so early but anyway, it was already dark and before I got to my house um, Before I turned on on the street to get to my house. There's a four ways four way stop stop sign and most of the time people are courteous to if you get there before they'll let you go and blah 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 so there were two cars ahead of me right so I waited for them to do their stop and whatever whatever the second car left did their thing and then so it was my turn so when I pull up there was a car I'm making a right turn the car ahead of me was making a left turn so I kind of waited for them to make a left turn and then I turned well, I turn, I never saw this cop, and next thing I know, I see like lights flashing behind me. So I'm like, I pull over because I'm thinking he, he gonna pass me something up and down the road. Well, he stopped me. Let me say this I never get stopped by the cop. I am a cautious driver. I have never gotten a ticket, ever. Other than the accident that I had back in May, but that somebody rear end me, I didn't get a ticket for that. They rear end me. So I, st I was like, what the hell he stopped me for? Uh, now I'm thinking maybe, you know, maybe you think a car looked like mine. I don't know, but I certainly didn't think that was had have anything to do with me. So when he came to the car, and I said, why did you stop me? Because I didn't do anything wrong. He said, you went through that um, stop sign. I go, what? No way, I didn't. He said, yes, you did. I said, no, I didn't. I did not. I said there were two cars ahead of me. I wait, had to wait for them to go. The car that was making a left turn, I even gave him the courtesy to go. And then I went. How did I go through that red stop, that stop sign? You did go through that stop sign. Can I have your registration? I said, I can prove it. I have a webcam. And he turned, he bent down and saw my webcam. Go, okay, yeah. I, this, at uh, this time I'm pissed. And so he took my driver's license registration and he asked me for proof of insurance and I showed him on my phone. I'm glad he didn't suggest because I was not going to let him have my phone. And um, so he looked at it and he said, okay. And he went off to 
his car and he waited 10 I mean I was there like 10 minutes and I'm thinking why is this man taking this long this is ridiculous meanwhile he's I call my daughter because I was pissed and she sort of calmed me down my mom calmed me down you know maybe he'll give you a warning you know whatever just calm down don't answer him so when he came back he said um I'm going to give you a warning um, because I noticed you did the same thing for you. I think he said four or five years ago, um, but that's a long time. So I'm going to give you a warning. Now, I was already calm, so I didn't say anything. But first of all, he lied about me going through the stop sign and he knew he was lying and he knew I knew he was lying then he went in the back and in, in his car and I guess I don't know I don't know but he obviously looked at my history whatever and saw nothing other than that accident I had in May which was not my fault and uh, he came with the excuse that I did this for for, I think he said five years ago, four or five years ago. I don't remember. And I looked at him. I wanted to say, well, I don't know how is that possible because I've only been in Florida for three years. Hmm. Huh. But I said nothing. And I had never got stopped either. So I was like, what is this man talking about? Anyway, he gave me this warning. And whatever. So. I was like. I calmed my ass down and just went home. Had a nice cup of tea and relax and watch a movie. I'm like, <sighs> anyway, apart from that, <sighs> I got this ticket. It's not ticket, this warning here. Look at his name. I'm like, you know, maybe I should look him up and see what kind of record he has. I don't think they do that, but they should. But anyway, anyway, I redid my guest room. I'm going to show it to you guys. Um, Thursday, my chair is coming. The chair, because I purchase, I purchase, oh, I didn't tell you guys. Last week, I went back to American Signature Place because I told you that since I made this um, purchase with my new sectional. It's so big. And the chairs that I have in there, they're also big, but they look small in comparison to this sectional. And the thing is like, you know, these telemarketers are getting on my nerve. Hold on. So anyway, these chairs, they look like they're not balanced to me. And so I went back to American Signature and I purchased the chair that went with the, with this sofa. Let me sh see if I have it here in my, because I did take a picture of it. Um, so is this chair so I purchased this chair you see focus in gray in gray so it will be here on Thursday so now my dilemma is <laughs> redoing my um, living room I'm um, redoing my living room with the chair 
and the chairs that I have in there I'm going to put it back in my blue area those chair was originally if you watch my other videos uh, those chairs were originally in my blue area and so I'm going to put it back in my blue area my the chairs that I have in my blue area right now it's a um, let me remind you guys what it looked like let's flip this okay so let's go in here turn some lights on so these chairs okay let's turn some light on here All right, these chairs, I am going to find another home for, I don't, I don't know. If I can't find a home for it, I am going to, I don't know, I don't know. But these chairs, these chairs, this off-white chair and this one, because I don't think you can tell on the camera, but it looks unbalanced to me. And so, I don't know if you can tell here a little bit. It looks unbalanced to me. And it's really bothering me. So, I purchased the other chair. And that chair, by the way, is the, the new chair that's going to go in here. It's actually very big. But it, it would balance this um, sectional. So, I'm going to put it here. It fits two people on that. And the picture it looks small, but it's it's a big chair. So I'm not putting anything here, um, other than the chair that come in on Thursday is going to be here. I'm going to remove this chair right here. These two chairs are going to go back. Excuse me, go back in the blue area, what I call my blue area, and then you know this picture that I have. I'm going to change it up a little bit. I'm going to add, I may record when I'm doing it. I'm going to, because this is, this is a, I didn't do this one, but this is easy. This is, this one looks like it was done with a blow dryer and I'm looking for all the cells that's in there. So I am going to add gold to it. I don't know exactly how I'll 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 record it when I'm get ready to do that. But anyway, like I said, these chairs are gonna go back in the blue area. These blue and white chairs, I like them. But but yeah. If you live in Florida, you want to purchase this chair, I will sell it to you. I have it on the marketplace, by the way. Anyway, let me give you a tour of my new guest room. And this is it. Another one of my painting. This one I did it with a blow dryer. Other one of my painting. Now you see this, let me show you something and tell you about. Let's see. So this is my new now this this th by the way this furniture it was my bedroom well not the bed but the nightstand and the um 
armoire. This was in my bedroom when I lived in Georgia. And I bought this from American Signature. There was a mirror here, just like this. But the movers broke these two mirrors. And then I just put sprinklers on them and Mod Podge to say, make them, you know, easy to touch so you don't get cut. And I did on that. But it used to look like the other one, like, you know. But anyway, this is my guest room. My guest room. And that's it. You know, I'm going to have to find... I'm going to have to find somebody else's house to help decorate. Because I can't keep decorating my house because, I mean, I'm running out of ideas and what to do. So... Well, one thing I'm going to do is once my son pick up this sectional that I have in my garage, I'm going to take a trip to California and I'm going to decorate his apartment because he, he lives by himself. He's single, no children. And, uh, which is overrated. I mean, you know, most of my friends there, they have grandchildren because the children have children. But my kids don't have any kids. I'm not rushing them because they say they're not ready. I trust they say they're not ready. They're not ready. When they're ready, they're ready. Anyway. But that's the update that I did. Um... I'm getting ready to do my laundry room because it's I need it to be more organized and it's not organized. I need it more shelves and organization in there. It needs it. And what else? Waiting to get that chair on Thursday. Um I'll do I'm trying to get more consistent with video. I'm trying to get this year to get more organized. Maybe start out with three. Three. I can't do every day. Ugh. I can't do every day. But I'm going to try and do three days a week. Three days a week. Hold me to it. Starting. Today is what? Today is. No, today is Thursday. No, today is Tuesday. So starting next week. I'm going to do three three videos a week. I don't know what day yet. Uh, I'll see. And once I break it down to a specific, no, specific day and time, I'll let you guys know. So with that said, I am going to close this video. And see you on my next video, which will be Thursday. I would record my new chair. After that, I don't know what else to do. I don't know what else. <laughs> as far as decoration goes, I don't know what to I have some menus that I want to try. Um, Yeah, I want to try a few things. Some vegan menu. The thing is, I don't always feel like cooking. I have to be in the mood to cook. I cook, but I just go in and whip up something real quick. But like real... I gotta be in the mood. I mean, I live by myself, so why should I... 
get in the kitchen and do full course meal and mm, I just go in the kitchen and throw something together and that's it when I eat it but anyway I will see you in my next video which will be Thursday um, when I receive my chair oh by the way I I wanted to show you something I saw this on Pinterest because you know how you have uh, I change out all the the pillows on my sectional and I didn't you know like I said I didn't use the the ones that it came with so I saw on Pinterest, I'm always looking for ideas. I saw on Pinterest, they arranged the pillow like this. And I thought it was cute because before I had one in front of the other. But I saw in Pinterest, they arrange it like this and I go, oh, that is so cute. So I did it. That is so cute. But I'm looking for one pillow to go here like those you know those what do you call those? those pillows that are like not round but what do you call them they're skinny not skinny they are like a tube i'm looking for something in gold to be like to put in the in the middle and I'm going to revamp that picture. I'm going to... Uh, I am going to change it up a little bit. Put some gold in there. And I may put some blue in there. With some sprinkle. I hope I don't mess it up. Well, you know what? You can't mess up a canvas. You just can't, especially when you have these abstract, because uh, you never know what you're going to get. So I'm going to do that, and I'll record when I do that. I have to get, I don't know if I have, I think I have gold paint and spray, but I need a actual gold paint and liquid. And then I, I need some gold sprinklers. I have, I think I have blue paint, but I need some blue sprinklers, but I'm going to change it up a little bit. Yeah. Guys, I need, I need somebody to let me do the, <laughs> let me do the house for them. And I would do it according to their liking, not mine. <laughs> I'm a little extra, but I'll do it according to what they like. So... No worries. No worries. Anyway, I am going to, let me put this, stand this thing up here. Yeah. All right. Okay, guys. That's all for today. Um, I will come back on Thursday and show you my chair. And see what else I have going on which is nothing just me and my shenanigans just bear with me oh before I go please I'm trying to grow my channel so if you stay this long and you like it please thumbs up my video subscribe to my channel share my video and I see you on my next video peace